What's going on? Welcome again to another T-Series Showcase. For today, I have my final BAM box for the year, the BAM Gamer Box. So, this came in today, or was it yesterday? Doesn't matter, it came in. And, again, got no tracking for these. Uh, the only BAM box this month that I got tracking for was the BAM Geek Box, so that already came in. I've gone through everything. And uh, this one, the Gamer Box, was the one I was excited for the most. Um, it's also bigger than all the other ones. Now, that being said, BAM did come out and say that they were getting a shortage of boxes because of, uh, you know, the pandemic. So it could just be that they didn't have any of their regular boxes, which it, it does kind of feel like that inside. It doesn't really seem like there's anything huge inside, like there would be a pop in this or anything. So sad but it's okay um now franchises i believe in this one was fallout cyberpunk 2077 sonic the hedgehog and god of war i believe those were the franchises for this box so let's go ahead and feel around in here all right i found the artist select card and i found the scratch off so let's go ahead and do the scratch off which is right here, and they have the Baths for Less on the back. Pretty useful. Well, that's the newest thing. Alright, scratch an instant winner symbol and win instantly. That's new, I didn't realize that yet. So that's a uh, thing at the bottom right there. So if you get a instant winner, you immediately win. So first I got a BAM Ultra Box. Second I just got BAM Box. And third was a Art Upgrade. So nothing there. Typical. Um... Throw that away. Now, artist select card, which would go with the one from last month, which was, I believe, Earthworm Jim. Here we go. Three, two, one. Ah, uh, there. That one. Serious thing. I do not... <clears throat> I remember Earthworm Jim. I do not remember who he's up against here. But there you go. There is the complete set. Um... Not horrible, just not my favorite ones. Um, I mean, I got a stack of artist like cards right here, so okay, that's neat. I'm, I'm sure I'll see what it was in the comments. All right, next, let's try and find the pin. Here it is, it's a bigger pin this month, so ooh, that's cool. So, Sonic, um, kind of like the victory thing right there. I like that, it's a good pin. Which is good, because after me complaining for months I ran out of space with a pin board, I just bought another giant two foot by three foot pin board, so huh, I won't have any issues now. Yeah, cool Sonic pin. Um, won't complain about that one. Uh, moving on, let's see the prop replica. Alright, this is from Fallout. It is a Nuka-Cola, which... That's good, because that means it's God of War and Cyberpunk left. So this looks like it's just a, a tin. Nuka-Cola. Oh, here we go. Got a little nutritional facts here. All products that are delivered by Nuka-Cola are Vault-Tec approved, marketing tested, and approved by the in-house gummy bear expert. Which is funny, because there's actually a typo on there. If you look really closely where it says approved, there is a space that shouldn't be there. Sorry. Uh, college popping in my head. Nutritional facts. Servings per bottle, 2. Percent of daily value. Calories is 74. Fat is 0. Unknown is 25 milligrams. Nitro is 1 milligram. Sugar is 25 milligrams. Protein is 0. Warning, this may ca uh, contain radiation. And there's a barcode. All right, not bad. It's just so uh, you can use it for whatever i guess as a cup or you can use it as storage uh fallout's not one of my favorite games i forgot to mention this box was the one i was excited for the most this month um except for fallout fallout i just i've never got into so for me i was just always like eh, whatever so i was really hoping that that would be the pin or something or the art print but it was that so that's okay all right not looking just showing you the coa there it says, BAM Authentic, Certificate of Authenticity. This fan art print from our fan art collection is an exclusive to BAM Box. 
and has been hand signed by the artist and is guaranteed to be authentic. Artist and print title can be verified at bamauthentic.com using the corresponding uh, box number. So, uh... All right, so Cyberpunk 2077, number 1,000 out of 2,200. Johnny Silverhand from Cyberpunk. I think I said that already, but whatever. Keanu Reeves, and uh, there's the artist signature. It's kind of hard to see. It's right there. And uh, there's your 1,000 on 2,200. Very cool. It's actually a cool art print. I, uh, I own the game, have yet to play it yet, uh, just because I'm kind of waiting for the glitches and what such to be taken care of um even though i'm gonna be playing it on the playstation 5 which is a little smoother but i'm kind of letting it do its thing um i'm not looking there's just the beckett coa right there so this is good from god of war now the symbol that they used for the franchise reveal was um it looked like it was from the newest god of war the fourth game for the playstation 4 so, I don't know who it could be, but here we go. One, two, three. All right, so it looks like it was um, the Witch of the Forest, which was Hera, I believe. No, wait. Is it Hera? Maybe, but there we go. Have to cheat. Freya. Oh, sorry, the dogs. So Freya, okay. Uh, not bad. Freya. So it was from the newest God of War game as well. Um, okay. Neat. All right, here we are. So December 2020, a few things are more fun than to take out time during the holidays to catch up on some gaming. It is best time to hit up those backlogs in this month's box. You'll find plenty of gaming goodies, or goodness, as we celebrate classics both new and old, as well as what we hope for in another one. So the artist select card right here. This is last month professional artist Todd Purnell brought us a beautiful rendition of Earthworm Jim. To finish the duel, he now brings us the Worms Forever Arch Nemesis Psycho Crow. Be sure to look out for the Hall of Oil variant, only 100 made. So that was, by the way, all the level ups at the bottom there. I didn't get one. I'm apologizing for the dogs in the background. I made sure no one was home. Oh, well. All right. Prop, 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 prop. This right here. The Nuka-Cola. Fans of Follow have always wondered what a Nuka-Cola would taste like. Well, we couldn't tell you, but we were able to collect some of the cans. We are excited to bring you one of the most iconic items in modern gaming history. For now, you can just have it and hold it. Okay. Next, we have the Artist Alley. We have... This month sees the release of the most anticipated game of the year, Cyberpunk 2077, which, again, super glitchy, so you can't do anything about that. Not only is it the follow-up to CD Projekt Red's classic The Witcher 3, it is also stars in the one and only Keanu Reeves as the major role. To celebrate with its release, professional artist Ali Adams brings us this gorgeous print. Collector's pin, the Sonic pin. For nearly 30 years, we've been playing Sonic the Hedgehog, and it has been... Time to put him in our box. This month's professional artist Tom Ryan brings us a brilliant pin set to tribute the blue speedster. Most of you receive Sonic. Some of you will get Tails. That's two fifty. Or the Eggman, aka Robotnik, ninety nine or fifty variant. At the bottom there. Okay. Lastly, celebrity autograph. God of War was the most celebrated game of twenty eighteen, and one of the reasons was the performance of. Danielle Biscuti as the Norse goddess Freya. The performance uh, garnered her a nomination for Best Performance at the 2019 BAFTAs. Biscuti has over 70 acting careers to her name in the last 20 years, making her one of the most prolific actresses in Hollywood since 2000. She is also a renowned singer and songwriter, and we are proud to bring her to you. Very cool. Um, yeah, this was a good box. Um... Again, I'm sorry about the dog barking. I can't stop that. I'm in a room. All right, so rating system. Remember, I'm still doing my 100 subscriber giveaway. In order to enter into that, you have to comment below what your favorite item in this box was. So for me, number five was the card. Just don't really care about the cards sometimes. Uh, four is the Nuka-Cola can. Don't really care for the series. 
Uh, three the Keanu Reeves Johnny Silver handprint. Two the autograph. I like it, but I'm just not thrilled. I I really like the pin. The pin was the best thing for me. Um, so that's it for this video, guys. If you like this video, please 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 make sure to like the button. Uh, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel, ring that notification bell, that way you know whenever I post a new video. And check out the links below for different links, like the BAM box, as well as Zobi and a few others. You can also see the T-Series Showcase eBay page and social pages, as well as the T-Series Collectibles eBay page, which is my own business. Well, that is it for the last BAM box of the year, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this, and I'll see you next time.